I'm Nina Sperano in Oshkosh. Today is National Human Trafficking Awareness Day. It's a day set by Congress and passed by the Senate. Neighbors here are giving light to the dark reality of human trafficking and its staggering statistics. A rally was held here earlier today in front of the sundial in downtown Oshkosh as a public way to fight back. I've seen a lot of situations and very broken women that have gotten into human trafficking. Tara Kozlowski of the Damascus Road Project, a nonprofit dedicated to fighting sex trafficking, teamed up with the Oshkosh Police Department to put the brakes on human trafficking. Most people think that a victim is running up to us for help, but it's not that way because victims are brainwashed, they're manipulated. Human trafficking involves the exploitation of people through force, fraud, or coercion for commercial sex or forced labor, according to the Department of Homeland Security. Children are especially targeted via social media, mobile devices, and interactive gaming. According to the International Labor Organization, human trafficking generates more than $150 billion in illegal profits annually. 50 million people are in modern day slavery around the world, and nearly 17,000 trafficking victims were identified in the U.S. in 2020. Raising awareness this month is one step to fight back. Do you know if raising awareness helps. I just didn't know if holding a sign was really worth it. And that night I had a conversation online with someone who knew about our rally and said, this is my story. And she started telling me about what happened to her. And I realized even if nobody else came, even if it was just me and her, I had to come to the sundial the next day and hold up signs just for her. And she came. Organizations like the Damascus Road Project helps find victims in the community and give them the tools they need to find a way out. What is it that you do that helps them make that choice to stop living that life or, or to get away? Well, I'm not sure if it's what I do, if it's something that I that we say, something that happens in those visits where you finally connect, where they really realize that someone cares about me, someone's going to help me when I get out, that there are places and people that will help me get my life on track. Since 2017, the Damascus Road Project has helped more than 550 victims of human trafficking or commercial sexual exploitation. The annual Stop the Traffic rally is just the jumping off point for the National Human Trafficking Awareness Month to help continue to help victims break free of human trafficking. If you or someone you know may be a victim and need some help, we've got a link to resources on our website. Just go to NBC26.com.